We are going on a two and a half hour road trip to Zurich, Switzerland. The closer you get to the water, the colder it becomes. But we did it just before we started clicking on this camera, y'all. My face feel like it's about to fall off. See what I'm saying though, y'all? Look how crazy this feels. Welcome to Zurich, Switzerland. Today, we are exploring new grounds and visiting never before seen landmarks. We're coming close to an end to our Europe trip, but not before adding some new adventures to the list that you definitely don't want to miss. Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> you know the routine. Hit that like and subscribe button, grab your drinks and your popcorn, and let's get this episode started right now. So it is currently 12.08 a.m. Me and Jazz will be waking up in about three and a half, four hours. We'll be hitting the road. So the last time y'all seen us, we were actually leaving Pisa, Italy. And uh, it was a legendary trip, man. If you haven't checked out that vlog, make sure you go check it out ASAP. But then after that, we went back to Milan. We picked up my dog, EK. None of this we filmed. Life of Keezy. Make sure you go subscribe. And then next you know, we drove all the way from Milan, Italy, back to Strasbourg, France. And we've been here for about five days. We've done absolutely no filming. It was cool just to kick up my dog life with And my wife, she got sick as soon as we got back. And then EK was sick. And then his wife, Hillary, was sick. So everybody was just sick but me because I got sick as soon as we got here for the first five days. So it's about time to caught up with everybody else. We actually have one day before we gotta head back to the United States to pick up our dog Zeus, who has been in training for his protection work. But we are going on a two and a half hour road trip to Zurich, Switzerland, which we've never been. We've been to Geneva, y'all know that, but we have not been to Zurich, Switzerland. And I hear Zurich, Switzerland is legendary in its own right. So me and my dog like the Keezy, we are about to set up the car. Before we head up the road trip, y'all know I gotta make it real comfortable for my wife, so I wish you get some good top level rest while I'm driving. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty legendary, man. So make sure you don't miss it, watch this video from beginning to end, and don't y'all miss the beat. And uh, without further ado, let's get to it. Break out this <laughs> Which button is it? All of them <laughs> EK had his car back for about two days, <laughs> five days to be exact. <laughs> and we get on in the front. Oh, shout out to my dog, E. Keezy, man. Woo! It's big break out there in the words of my dog, Keezy, man. So if y'all been watching every video, this is Life with Keezy, and he's a professional basketball player out here in Europe. You want to make sure you go to his channel, you want to make sure you subscribe, and we actually did something real funny. Tap in. Yeah, definitely tap in. We did the Korean noodle challenge, the two times hot Korean noodle yeah. challenge. Motherfuckers tweaking, man. That's <laughs> why the motherfuckers so hot, they make no goddamn sense. <laughs> but their stuff is bubbling right now. <laughs> But, we but, did it just before we started clicking on this camera, y'all. Man. And he just recovered from being full sick type flu. Oh, yeah, I was, I was dressed up. Yeah. Next time you see us, we're going to be clicking on the camera, getting Jazz's car, getting situated, and we will be heading to Zurich, Switzerland. And look who we have with us. And in case y'all are wondering, yeah, she wake up like that. She that fine all the time. Oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> The one thing about driving overseas is so you're lost in translation the entire time and then the etiquette here is different than America. So you don't be knowing the sidewalk road, it all looks the same. And I ain't trying to sound ignorant. I've been driving all around Europe for the last couple of months. And it all looks the same. You know what I mean? And then when you think you're on a sidewalk, you're on a road, and then everybody honks at you because you ain't moving, and vice versa. Yeah, and then they got cameras everywhere here in Europe, so they just find you. They just so my dog EK got a tab. Like I just told him, just add it to my tab. I take care of it, bro. So we actually got so overwhelmed, and it's freezing outside. It's always cold. So we like, man. As we're looking for other stuff to do, I'm like, you know, I'm just gonna jump in the back and look for some stuff. But more likely, I'm just gonna fall asleep. <laughs> now this is where I. Mm. I know that's what I'm saying, but the same ticket break right here. Oh, there's cars. Oh, okay. See what I'm saying though, y'all? Look how crazy this feels. This feels wild, you know what I mean? So, I guess we just park anywhere. Everything seems legitimate, but I don't know if it is or not. Nah, it got badges on the name, that can't be. I have no idea. All right, we just gonna go out the way we came in. 
let y'all find a parking spot. So after finally finding a parking spot and yet another meter that we couldn't translate, we are finally onto our first adventure, which is the Gross Moonster. Located in the heart of Zurich's old town, it is one of the most recognizable landmarks in the city. This is one of Zurich's major churches, but it's the history to it that makes it a popular tourist spot. It was built back in the 1100s, making it one of the most oldest churches in Zurich. From the stained glass windows to the architecture, it's clear that there's a lot of history within these walls. Now we are making our way down to what's called the crypt, which is the oldest part of the church. It's filled with murals and statues that date back all the way to the early 1400s. All right, y'all, so as y'all can see, we are in the crypt, but we are in a church that is over 900 years old. Like, you can't really fathom how, how long 900 years ago actually was, but we're in the crypt of this 900 year plus old church. So it's the oldest still standing room in Zurich, Switzerland. Wow. That's crazy. Like, imagine how many people from way, 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 way back in the day have been in this room. Totally different time, totally different people, totally everything is different, right? And then all these years later, decades and decades and decades, and we're in here on YouTube <laughs> sharing this with y'all. Could you imagine the people way back in the day, like, thinking, they probably couldn't even fathom this day and age that we're in right now. And that statue right there, pretty legendary too. I actually don't know the history or nothing with it, let's be honest, but it looked dope. This guy's name right here is Charlemagne. And this goes back to the 1400s. That's some history for y'all, for real. Listen, I was knocked out in that car ride. I don't know what it is, but when I get in the car, I get so tired. And it don't matter how much she just got done sleeping in the car. For real, I could be sleep all night, all yeah, day. Once I sure. get in that car and that car moves, I'm out like a light. Facts. But anyway, we are here now and uh, yeah, wow. But it's a complete ghost out here right now. I'm assuming because it's cold. Obviously everything is better in the winter time or in the summertime and not the winter time when it comes to water. But nonetheless, it looks beautiful. Even though it's cold, you can literally see the snow on the drone. <laughs> As yeah, I was flying in. For sure. <laughs> but anyway, let's walk through here. Let's see what it's looking like. Get some pictures, get some reels. Follow us on Instagram and let's go. Woo-wee! But first, we need tickets. First of all, why is my baby looking like he's in LA? You're in full <laughs> Switzerland. Where is your coat? From Minnesota, baby. Oh my goodness. You know what I mean? That's what we do, Minnesotans, man. Single dog entry, single. Dog. They don't know we a child, look. It's two more dollars. It's five dollars. Just. <laughs> Adult is five, the kid is three. Just get two adults. I mean, you could get two kids. We are two big kids. No, just do the adult. <laughs> oh, do it. Just do the adult, Ain't man. What do you say, it's like two dollars? It's a ghost town right now. You don't know how to manage means, you don't know how to manage means. Okay, we ain't gonna do that, all right, because we on YouTube, we want to be bad influence to, to the kids and everybody out in the world. We gonna get the adult tickets. Turn the camera on, baby, go over there. Ooh, got down. Got him. Yeah. You know we could have just jumped over the joint like New York just jump over there. For sure, but we're not gonna be right, you know be niggas in uh Swedish. in Switzerland. That's a Swedish shit. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's get a little shelter real quick. Woo! <laughs> imagine doing a polar plunge like you said in that. Sheesh! Could you imagine that one? Just jumping in there? So first you gotta take these stairs. And then, there's an observation deck. I ain't gonna lie, Jazz right, I shoulda. I shoulda worn my jacket. The closer you get to the water, the colder it becomes. And the windier it becomes. So we were actually at the wrong observation deck. It gets better. We gotta go down there. What's going on over here in this corner? Look like a little heated spot. Oh, hell no. The white side is saying, let's go investigate. But my black side is saying, like boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Let's see. Wow. Oh. No, this is crazy. And let me tell you, crazy it definitely was. So Rhine Falls is the most powerful waterfall in all of Europe, if you couldn't tell from this video clip. It's said that the waterfall formed in the last ice age around 14,000 to 17,000 years ago. 
Now this cave is one of the many viewpoints where you can get up and close and personal on the waterfall. Oh, that was dope. That was. Cold, but dope. For sure. <laughs> Y'all come here in the winter time, you gotta suit up. Cause out by the car, it's not that bad for us. You get here, I can barely feel my fingers. Now we are going down there. This is pure ice. All I keep thinking of is this whole thing we're a fall right now. Oh, we're burnt. Oh no, Big Jack and Rose Titanic. For sure. Legendary experience. Don't you miss it? Come here, enjoy it. Take it in. Do all the above and uh, lay a lock. Cause they got the Love Lock Bridge here, like. Like, like how it is at Paris. It's craziest. As you go upstairs, it gets warmer and warmer. So Jazz actually figured out that this is the way to go out. 10 points for Jazz. <laughs> no stairs for Jazz. No stairs. <laughs> Elevator only. Let's get it. And I say, my fingers. Do I have white around my lips? <laughs> the white around your lips. Remember all about the Benjamins when Mike Epps said, uh, the white around your lips. <laughs> Putting this cold in those stairs yeah. is pretty excessive. Yeah. But we are done. That was really dope. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that as much as we did. That was legendary. I think I had frostbite on my fingers. Wow. Look at that there. How legendary is that? Dang, too bad we didn't see this in the beginning. I know, right? We need to take a step. I don't know. Maybe this is the only way out, not going down. I'm pretty sure you can take this way down, too. Yep, look right. Embarrassing. Hey, well, we, we enjoyed the process. Exactly. Now see, this is what I'm talking about, y'all, from earlier. All right, we left the waterfall spot and rain falls, and now we're here and we're on the street. You got a dude on a scooter right here in front, and then look to the left. You got all these trains. So it's like, this is wild. Like, you don't even know where to go. Like, and this is how you know we're in the right lane, because look, you see the arrows right here. Yeah, that was crazy. Insane. Google Maps overseas don't work that good, I'm telling you. You ain't got nothing else. Ways, ways be tripping over here too. But I just want to tell y'all that. It's getting dark. Light might not be the best, but we're making a shake and uh, we'll be heading back to Strasbourg, France tonight. So we literally just hung out here literally for a day, slept in a car. <laughs> <laughs> Live life. <laughs> oh, there's a park right there if you want to. And, uh, park. Yeah, good. Where is it right here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Good job, baby. So now we are just walking around the town. Taking his last little bit of Zurich in, yep. and uh, yeah, enjoying the night out here. And uh, I don't know how we're gonna randomly flip on this camera, but we might, we might not. Next time you might see us, might, we might be here in Zurich. Yep, ne no. Next time you see us, it might be the morning, and we might be in Strasbourg, France, leaving to another country. You never know. You never know. Until then, you never know. <laughs> We have made it to the airport, but we are in Istanbul, Turkey. Look at that. She in her bag right now. Let me find out. You're going to like this a lot. Look, is the seat matching my baby other side, or is the other side matching my baby? I don't know. You tell me. So, we fucked up. <laughs>